we see that about uh, 25 minutes or so after the uh, uh, Tesla, Tesla coil was stopped, we gather data on the water and of course the water already has a quite a strong baseline but what we saw was that the, uh, the collective process of the water retaining the level of increased biophoton exchange within, we can see that there is a dynamical image of the baseline of the lab water. You see that clearly? This is and what we are actually now uh, capturing is a continuous what we call a dynamical image. So just to, just to give a value, we can see that the water, the area of the water is very consistent all the way. This is time, time on the x-axis and area which is the number of pixels on the y-axis. So uh, here we see that a mean value, so let's go like the midpoint here, and the mean value here is roughly about 980. And the mean value after the charge is 2281. So, so that is supportive to show that the influence of Tesla lights has definitely raised the number of pixels. And thereby we can also see that the sharper edges that the water has also began to get smoothened.